Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you a little cool trick and uh, a little function in R that is going to produce a little animation. Uh, so let's just get right to it. This is a, uh, I've opened a script, a new script, and this is where I do, whenever coding for, func for functions, it's nice to do it on the side in an R editor script as opposed to doing it in the main console, in the R console. So here's the console, the script that I've already written. It's uh, only three lines. It's a function that takes one input and that is uh, decided by you. The input is called angle. And what it does is it uh, takes, makes a pie chart based on this data and basically uh, creates a pie chart that is going to run through many inc uh, many different angles of uh, initial angles of orientation and so what it will produce it'll give the effect of an animation so there's a couple functions in here that you have to be familiar with the sort function which is self-explanatory the rainbow function which produces cool color gradients ceiling function which uh, will give us the will cut off the decimal uh, portion of a, a number and just give us the uh, estimated up round it up uh, or yeah or a ran uh, unif which is a random uniform uh, random variable generator I'm saying to generate one random uniform variable between 60 and the length of our variable that we are uh, using for uh, this pie chart and the labels I've removed and I've removed them by some uh, real awkward way by creating a vector of blanks so because I, I just couldn't find a way of getting rid of the labels and the initial angle is what is going to be incremented by this for loop over here. So this loop is going to run from 1 to the angle that we define in the function and that is going to be placed over here and so the angle of this pie chart if you could imagine if it starts like this then in the next increment it's going to shift a little to the left and in the next increment it's going to shift a little more and so on and at the same time this color portion is going to be constantly changing so it's going to give a cool effect so let's just run this the way you run something from the editor you can highlight the portion of code you want to run and you click right here in the run line or selection and it runs the, uh, runs the code in the console and now all we have to do is to, to run the function the name of the function I've named the function a and it takes one parameter so let's just put in 360 for our for our angle okay so that's our angle so let's hit enter and see what happens boom let's put some music on for that it's pretty trippy I think it's pretty cool I think this is the way to keep all this math and the statistics fun keep it fun keep it serious to begin with so why not add the element of fun right let's run that again I hope you enjoy this uh, till next time make sure to check out my other tutorial videos I got R tutorials Excel access PowerPoint math statistics and other computer tricks subscribe to my channel and click on our sponsors ads that keep these videos coming to you for free until next time, if you appreciate this, have a great day.